so trash. <laughs> Buffalo, dude. Buffalo. You saw you saw me barely touch it, right? Is it, Don't make oh, that one right there. You knew this was gonna happen. That's why there was a backdrop. Oh God damn it! Oh. Let's see. How do I? Hey guys, I don't work at Radio Shack. <laughs> Fucking telling me how to do equipment stuff. There we go. <laughs> Jesus Christ. There we go. It's also loose, right? Uh, I gotta, I gotta hold my shit like a rapper. The whole show. Let's go. What? Yeah, I'll try. Oh, is there a wireless one? Oh, shit. We got options? Okay. I'm gonna put this back. It's on now. Check, check. Nope, nope, nope. So what do y'all want to do after this? <laughs> it's on now, right? to do <laughs> I say you it's not it's still not on I can go back to that one yeah. all right here we go <laughs> let's fuck it yeah that'll be fine we can just leave the, the core of this one off that's okay <laughs> I'm not you see I'm not even touching it right like that's I mean, this shit's bound to move around. The wireless not shit be good, man. <laughs> Bro, this shit feels like... <laughs> this shit feels like I'm like the base of an orgy. And I'm just like... Oh, and, 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 and the whole fucking time. <laughs> Alright, let's hope this is the one. Let's see what happens. Yeah. I fucking hate this city, man. I just should have. This shit would never happen in Albany. I wish I could turn y'all's mic off right now. I really do. <laughs> Anybody gay? Oh, really? Oh, yeah, I can't see your haircut in the dark, but yeah. Oh, yeah. How long have you been uh, lesbian? Biologically, what were you born? Female. Oh, I appreciate you. What's your, what's your name? Carl. I go by Axel. Charlie, but you go by Axel. Ooh, the gangster ass name. How'd you land? How'd you land on Axel? Axel's my best friend. Your best, you let your best friend pick your name? Oh my God! My, I could never. My best friends would be like, "Your name, Baby Dick." From here on out. <laughs> you chose the name? How'd you How'd you land on Axel? Like an Axel. <laughs> <laughs> you built like a carburetor. I don't know. <laughs> Now you go like a transmission, but that's a go. <laughs> oh I was like, where is it? I know there's something in there. <laughs> Actually, you're the fucking best. Oh my goodness. Thank you for being such a sweetheart. We should go get some. We should go get some bitches after this. <laughs> Let's go. I had a 14 year ago, so I am down. 
Who, uh, who, who are you married to? Male, female? Uh, another trans guy. Another trans guy. Um, same situation, biologically? Yeah. Okay, gotcha. Mm -hmm. Why didn't it work out? Yeah. Well, that's me for a woman with no teeth. <laughs> <laughs> he had her while I was taking care of him because he was, he was paralyzed, basically. Shut the fuck up. <laughs> you were taking care of him because he was paralyzed. What? What, what had happened to him that he was paralyzed? Uh, uh, like a muscle disease. And he met her through TikTok. And he was DMing her like, will I ever walk again? And, he, and the medium was like, yeah, you about to walk out on your marriage. Um, where'd you meet him? Where'd you meet him? I've known him for 10 years. No way. What's up? You have a stage name? My name is Gunner Down. Gunner Down! Oh my god, you and your 9mm. Uh, with Gunner Down as the name, I picture you going like full Rambo, just shirtless. And then you come out, your big line is like, you know I stay strapped. And you pull out a, you pull out a strap on. <laughs> Actually, you're such a sweetheart. One more time for Axel, everybody. Bro, <laughs> you scared the shit out of me, dog. <laughs> bro, I'm not Chris Rock, though. I'll kick you in your chest, bro. I swear to God. Are you dapping me or you want the hoodie or my wallet? What do you want? <laughs> careful, dog. Careful. Do y'all watch Criminal Minds? One handsome motherfucker at a time, dog. Did you have some fun? I ain't got jokes like this motherfucker right here. I'm Juan Moore. I told him when I got here. I've been watching him on YouTube. And, I, and, I, and I'm meeting him for the first time tonight. I'm seeing him live in person. Like a lot of us, I'm sure. For the first time, but I've been watching and me and my girl, my baby mama, and, I, and my girl comes to me and she's like, Shamar, you're the sexiest motherfucker in the world, Jenny, you're the father of my daughter, but I want to fuck Matt right. <laughs> Check this out. Then we're going to meet the motherfucker, but you ain't going to fuck. <laughs> but the, re the reason I'm here is because I like seeing motherfuckers win. I like to see motherfuckers in And, this, and this, this young white boy, who wants to say nigga so bad, <laughs> he does all his friends are black. <laughs> but he can't say it, because he'll get cats. But when he comes to my house, I'm going to say, get it out of your system. Nigga, 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 nigga. <laughs> the, the, the reason I'm here is because I've never met this man. I just watched him on YouTube, and I was like, yo, this motherfucker's funny, and he's pretty. And, and no, but like, pretty people ain't supposed to be funny. Kevin Hart is not pretty. He's short, and he's funny. Chris Tucker, motherfucking damn! Okay? Dave Chappelle is rich as fuck. He's not Chef. pretty. True. I'm pretty, goddammit. <laughs> But he's honest, he's real, and he's funny. And I DM'd him like a bitch. And he DM'd me back like a bitch. So now we got a romance going on. And I said, I'm gonna come to your show, and I'll pay you like a bitch. But he did give me the tickets for free. So I'm gonna get off this stage, but I just wanna say, I believe that this dude is on his way. He sells out every show. And I believe, I believe you are going to see Matt right. And whatever is in his heart, and like all, all his jokes, and all of that stuff. And I want to see this motherfucker in front of a bunch of dicks. Because I think he can handle himself. But my point is, 
Let's applaud the bravery, the boldness, the unapologetic Matt Wright. And let's watch him grow. Let's watch him grow. Appreciate you, man. Thank you, brother. Thank you, man. Thank you, bro. Can I add it? He's stealing. Go <laughs> stairs this way. Yeah, be careful. One more time for Tay Diggs. Oh, yes, do match. He's a matching snakeskin boots. It's both snakeskin? Python, yeah. Python? Fuck yeah. Not, not, none of those gardener snake bitches. <laughs> These are coupled up, obviously matching. Nice. How long? Five years. Five years? Where'd you meet? In North Carolina. In North Carolina? That's specific. Where? <laughs> we met at a bar. You met at a bar? At, well, yeah. I was underage and drunk. <laughs> hey, stop talking, stop talking, stop talking, stop talking, stop talking, stop talking, stop talking. <laughs> Under 21, okay. You almost ruined the show. He approached you or you approached him? I don't remember. You don't remember? <laughs> also not a good sign. Uh, what do you guys do? Basket weaver. Basket weaver? What the fuck? Bro? You married to a fucking hunter-gatherer? What the fuck? You work for the fucking Easter Bunny, dog? That's coming up, that time of the year. That's actually how he got her at the bar. He just, he laid down a trail of eggs. It was like... <laughs> and then he had one of those big picnic baskets up on a stick like this, and then she went underneath it, and he went, ah, got her. <laughs> like a fucking Looney Tune. <laughs> how long you been doing that for? Five years. Five, five years? Did she take your fucking manhood, dog? What did you do beforehand? Work at a steel mill? Coal mines. Coal mines? Are you serious? <laughs> Man made you start weeping baskets. Um, sorry. Do you like it? Yeah. Come on, man. It's just us. You enjoy the job? It's fine. It's all right. What would you like to do if you could do anything in the entire world? Any job? Fly a helicopter. Fly a helicopter. Interesting. Man, I, I used to love helicopters, but I'm also a Lakers fan. And you know what's fucked up? He's wearing a black mamba on his feet. <laughs> Can I see one of the boots? Are you able to take one of them off? This is the real deal, man. This is some real shit right here. <laughs> Smell his boot. What the fuck's wrong with you people? Jesus Christ. This is so stupid. As if, as if I would ever. You guys are dressed like the Wiggles, you know that, right? Like a Fifty Shades of Sacramento. You guys are all different. Did you purposely dress in, in different colors? I saw my face on the shirt. That was the least concerning part of the entire organization. It was really the color coordination is what's really impressive. Yellow, red, kind of pinkish, and then, and then green. Nice. Uh, those photos are trademarked, though, and I'm going to need $35,000. Uh, we're going to have to press charges. And you guys look like you have the money. So I'm, fucking, I'm following through for sure. I'm sorry, I've just never met a pallet of pussy before. This is... I feel like I'm trying to fuck in like the paint section of, of Home Depot. You're just like, mm. Mm. You live in Washington, state or DC? Is a big foot up there? You haven't found him yet? Keep looking. <laughs> and make him wear the blue blazer when you find him. <laughs> I, 
I can't get over the Wiggles design. I really can't. Like, it's... <laughs> What's your guys' song? Good pussy. Yummy, yummy. Good pussy. Yeah, yeah. The square shit. I don't know. I don't know the rest of the fucking songs, dude. Are you guys all single? Kind of. Sort of. Sort of? <laughs> Only in Sacramento or what? Is it... What's that? Is it going on TikTok? It depends on how much of a disaster your lives are. I don't know. You're single. I am. What about you? I'm married, but I'm, I'm available for free drinks. <laughs> married, but available for free drinks. You out of your fucking mind? You know what? It makes total sense that you're the one dressed like a red flag. That actually takes total sense. <laughs> this completely checks out. Wow. Okay. So married. Married. Single. Divorcing. Divorcing. Green flag. <laughs> Look at that shit. Nice. Yeah, they're so... And, and then caution. Like, what's your deal? You know what I mean? You're just, you're just, you're just kind of single floating around. Like, well, we'll see. Yield. <laughs> Should have left ten minutes ago. Yeah, we got to wrap this up because I'm, I'm trying to go back to the hotel and taste the rainbow. <laughs> <laughs> you scheduling some dick? What are you doing? What's, 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 the, what's the move? You were just looking? That's worse. Who are you texting right now? You were just looking at who's text? I saw the I saw the blue bubbles on there. Who was it? Who's more important than me right now? I want to know. Who's number one in your life right now? Who is it? No, I was just looking. You were just looking at what? It better be pictures of me. <laughs> it better have been my Instagram. Yeah. Show me if it was me. And bitch, don't you scroll to another app. I swear to God. If you open another app. Just... You want to be real? <laughs> be present. <laughs> what is your name? Lana? Lana. <laughs> Lana? Lana. You're saying exactly what I'm saying. <laughs> Lana. Lana. <laughs> Lana? Lana. Did I not just fucking say that? <laughs> Spell it. L O R N A. Lorna. Not even a real name. I see why you mispronounced it. Lorna? What's your last name? The Rings? Lorna the Rings? Whatever, dude. You fucking nerds. Whatever. <laughs> you drove 200 miles for me to sit on your phone? Were you checking directions for the drive back? Is that what it was? Mm. Come on, Lana! <laughs> what was that? That was just four vowels in a row. <laughs> Bro, British people just say fuck consonants, dude. Look at me and my ball. Bro, who the fuck are you people, dude? Say letters! You just dip on half the words sometimes. What do you do? I'm a buyer. You're a buyer? Oh. Uh, we're all buyers. I can't even say it because... You won't even say it? Why? Is it people? Like, what is it? What do you mean buy? How bad could it possibly be? She just said something that was so not a word. Aluminium? Aluminum! Die! Die! Avada Kedavra! Avada Kedavra! Avada Kedavra! You're all dead! You're all so dead, dude! Oh, fuck y'all, man. It's not a word.
Millennium, where are all the extra letters coming from? You're doing too much. All the aluminium. No, fuck that, guys. You're wrong. I'm, in th I'm, I'm thinking of the spelling of it in my head. There's no I after the M. Alum. Nope. Not gonna do this right now. You're not gonna. You don't have to make me look stupid. Aluminum. Whatever, dude. Fuck you guys, dude. You get one word right and you think you're fucking hot shit. Does anybody have any weed? That's gonna help me get through this like tremendously. Good. Is weed legal in Alabama? It's not. Good, because I I personally love to vape. Uh, just regular, just regular, um, just regular. It's a hookah stick. It's pure nicotine. How cool are the cops? How cool are the cops gonna be? I feel like I feel like this this, this scene in um, fucking Gladiator. Just fucking give me a. <laughs> Why'd you let me do that? Shouldn't have done that. Thank you, officer. <laughs> Appreciate you. Thank you for it's it's been a white privilege. <laughs> I appreciate it. No, you do not have a white privilege card. Let me see this. White privilege trumps everything. Wow, dude. There's a back? Yes. This card grants its bearer happiness and success because it's the color of your skin and not the choices you make that determine your abilities to be successful. <laughs> Dog. Alright, now give me the N word pass. Trades, tradesies, tradesies. Tra yeah. Nope. Y'all thought, y'all thought, y'all thought. A white man owns the company that sells these. Really? <laughs> well, if that isn't reparations. That's a beautiful thing right there. A black man selling white privilege. That, you know. I love 2023. I'm actually totally okay with that. How did you know he had the cards? We're all now. He pulled out the card in line. That might be the whitest thing to do, by the way. <laughs> you, you, you ever heard of white privilege? Yeah, I know it's a thing. No, it's really a thing. You gotta, you gotta know a guy. You gotta, you, gotta, sorry, you gotta know a couple guys. You gotta know a group of guys. We all meet on Wednesdays. We all wear white. You should really come in the morning. It's, it's, uh, it's, it's a good time. It's, uh... it's literally 13 bucks on Instagram. I didn't know. 13, like the amendment? <laughs> Has anybody ever dated somebody that they felt like because of how religious they were, it was kind of like a hindrance to the relationship? Yes. Did you, did you really? Yes, a preacher. He was a preacher? Oh, fuck. <laughs> what, uh, what, what, what religion? He sold sharks. Penic penic penicillin? What is that? Um, scary. Say believe in speaking in tongues and things. Lucky you. <laughs> I'm not Pentecostal, but I can read lips. <laughs> I'll, be right. I'll be okay. What was his nationality? He was white. Okay, just wanted to make sure this wasn't just regular Spanish. <laughs> <laughs> how, how old was he? 23. How old are you? 21. 21, okay. Was Preacher like his full time job? No, he was a plumber. <laughs> so he's not speaking in tongues, he's just, just talking shit.
<laughs> you don't know if he was like talking to the devil or describing his work. Like, you flush it, it's gonna. <laughs> <laughs> Somebody left a demon in this toilet. <laughs> That's disgusting. 21. Have you seen anybody now? Uh, I'm talking to someone. Nice. Okay. No. no. What? Oh, it could be a good person. Where'd you meet this guy? I met him at a frat party. <laughs> Have you learned nothing? In what world do you think that's better? <laughs> okay. You traded holy water for fucking jungle juice. You don't have any kids or anything, right? No. No? Okay, good. You're 21 in Kentucky, that's like late. So I, didn't know. <laughs> I know some 21 year old grandmas who live, who live in fucking <laughs> Louisville, you know what I mean? Oh! What the fuck that is, dude? I'm not pronouncing it like I've got a dick in my mouth. <laughs> Ooh! Use all your fucking letters, okay? What are you guys, fucking British? <laughs> black dudes are the funniest people on the but That's a black dude for sure. I know a black dude's laugh. I did all of February. I just fell asleep. The black dude's laughing, man. Like, that was my ASMR. That brings me such joy. What's your name, bro? Uh, Tori, man. Who are you here with? <laughs> man. I've never been more sure somebody's with a side chick in my life. Black dudes answer you without even answering. They really do. Who are you here with? Ah. <laughs> What's that? I said we good. Ain't nobody's cameras out. You all right, man. You okay? <laughs> but don't start no shit, man, because I'll fucking boom. Got your ass. Boom. Got you on camera, sir. Suspicious. <laughs> oh, man. I hope I get a side chick someday. <laughs> Just go do all the things I'm not supposed to in public and shit. No side. One more time. No side, just the main. That's, the, that's your main girl? Yeah, you felt the need to reiterate that? <laughs> you felt the need. You're like, just to make sure. What's that? You almost got me in some shit. <laughs> you almost got you in some shit, man. Okay, this is your one and only girlfriend. Don't do that. Don't sit down. All right, sit down. Stop making this woman think fuck the Tory fucked you. Okay, do not do that. Don't say that. No, you don't. You don't know who's sitting back there. Who's the girl you know? I know Brittany. You know Brittany? Oh. He broke up with Brittany forever ago. Right? Next subject. <laughs> What, you don't like talking about black history? <laughs> Chapter one, Brittany. You said everybody knows Brittany? Yeah. Brittany sounds like a hoe now. Everybody knows her? Hey, Tori, don't say that. Yeah, you are. Oh, man. Oh, man. We about to piss a 
ghost off. <laughs> I love your sense of humor. You're fantastic. I love, I love you're able to like laugh off this guy's This pot's fucking sick. Shut up, I'm taking it. Can I, this will be the last thing I brought you up. Can I, can I ask how? Or what from? Breathing problem, a lot of oxygen. Or maybe you took his breath away. <laughs> She said when her husband was in the hospital, he was telling the doctors, like, no, this is all her fault because she took my breath away. Oh, that's so sweet. God damn it. <laughs> How do you get your name? My name yes, ma'am. What is it? Sherry. Sherry. That's old as fuck. <laughs> God damn. You must have been, been the one Frankie Valley was singing about. <laughs> What happened with your ghost story? Uh, I was in Monterey, Mexico. Monterey, Mexico. You look like you're not from there. So visiting. <laughs> I was in Mexico City and I was driving back to uh, Kansas. And I went through Monterey. I was in a I was in a hotel room that night. Yeah, in our room, I was with three other people, also witnesses to this event. Mm -hmm. And there was a probably like an eight foot. Figure in our room. There was an eight foot figure in your room? Yeah. Mexicans are not that tall. <laughs> so instinctually, you're like, that's not supposed to be here. <laughs> Unless it was just like two of them in a trench coat. Like, you know, you know, you know, you know when kids are trying to get into an amusement park and they're just fucking. <laughs> One adult, please. Okay, so you saw you saw this tall ass figure. Okay. That's a true story, man. That's the end of it. No. Okay. <laughs> Still going. So, it definitely it made an indescribable sound that I cannot. It made an indescribable sound. You mean Spanish? <laughs> <laughs> this was this was just housekeeping. <laughs> <laughs> He woke up at 9 a.m. and just heard, I clean. Ah! <laughs> Dia de los muertes! <laughs> so it made this sound. How would you describe this sound? Like a whisper scream. Like, Do it. Honestly, like a whisper scream? Was it the ghost of the yin yang twins? What the fuck? <laughs> And then did it just disappear? Did it walk away? It levitated over the bed. Oh my god! It levitated over the bed? It, all right, so it levitated over the bed, and you were like, ah! 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 <laughs> Please don't! <laughs> Could you guys in the back hear what happened? You can hear the story okay? I right, just wanted to make sure. Yeah, basically he was in Mexico, he was doing some gay shit with his friends. And, uh, scared him a little. What's your name? Jesse. Jesse, pleasure to meet you. What do you do work wise? I uh, take care of my two younger brothers. You take care of your two younger brothers? What do you want to do after the kids are grown? Um, <laughs> I, I was going to school for forensic anthropology. You, you were going to school for forensic anthropology. What's that? <laughs> so, um, basically, I would like, look at dead bodies and try to figure out uh, what happened to them. Did you get to the point in the school where you were like face to face with a dead body? No, I, don't, I quit going to school because I lost my job. <laughs> 
You wait, hold on. What? I, would you rather I not repeat that? I don't care. She basically she stopped going to school because she started having some negative thoughts and wanted to focus on some health care, some self care. We'll, we'll we'll phrase it that way. She was, she was not doing so well mentally, so her parents were like, here, watch our other two kids. <laughs> <laughs> oh, fuck, Jesse! You're in no position! Oh, my God. <laughs> well, good luck. I hope you don't end up looking at two more dead bodies. <laughs> <laughs> Whatever, you guys. <laughs> would you be, like, in, like, the morgue? Is that where, 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 where like, your work would take place? Could be. That's I also fucking... thought about doing Field work, so like going where the body is. Field work. Not a term I would be using in the South, but. <laughs> Field of work, maybe. But, um. <laughs> I roasted you. I figured I at least owed you a conversation. So thanks for being so sweet. Um, don't put me in your note. <laughs> Take my belt off? If I do, will you hang yourself with it? I've never been more sure somebody's from Miami in my fucking life. Uh, uh, worse. Dry Miami. <laughs> Gross. Ugh. What school you go to? Rollins. Community College. Yeah. It's a private school? Sorry. Just say you came from money. Just say that. When did Paltrow's jury selection team? Is that a real thing? Wasn't no. she selling pussy scented candles? She's a what? Blog and holistic stuff. Now. She's a blog? It's called The Goop. Goop. The Goop? That sounds like what she should have named her pussy scented candles. <laughs> I wish I had been more up to date on that trial. All over TikTok. It'll all come up, up on your phone now that we've talked about it. That's fucking scary. <laughs> oh, way worse. Women's basketball. <laughs> What's that? Your mom plays professional basketball? No way. So you definitely don't come from money. Ah! I just did something your mom could never do. I dunked on your bitch ass, dog. That was a low blow. Oh, I'm sorry. But it was also such a layup, you know? Was your mom good? Would you say she was the Dykel Jordan of the WNBA? <laughs> that is pretty cool, though. Did you get to go to a lot of games growing up? Yeah, I did. You sat courtside? Absolutely. Was it lonely? <laughs> we have to get out of here, you guys. We do. Why? Because I have a, a fantasy WNBA team to go manage. <laughs> There's also police officers here. I met a, uh... Officer Swindell. Officer Swindell. Did you meet Officer Swindell? Oh, is that his wife? This is him. Oh, man, he said you take forever to come. He said that before the show. And he dared me that I wouldn't say it at the show. You seriously gotta work on that. That's his trigger figure. And they really, like, he's got a... Oh, man. Now, he said you guys have great sex. He said he beats it up like you fit a description. He really does. He said sometimes he lets her wear the bulletproof vest and everything. <laughs> like, they won't play. She puts on the bulletproof vest and then she's a teacher. <laughs> Sorry, I'm not one of your students. My bad. Sorry about that. <laughs> That's not even the last school shooting joke of the show. I lived in a crematory. You lived in a crematory? Yeah. My old apartment was a crematory. Why do you know that? 
Who the fuck just knows that statistic? Nerd. It's right next to a nursing home? The convenience. Beth. There's a cemetery by the children's hospital? Come on, Pennsylvania. Have a fucking heart, man. You do not put a cemetery next to a fucking children's hospital. You put it next to the school. I told you there was one more. I fucking told y'all, man. I didn't know where or how it was gonna go, but we fucking, we found it. <laughs> All right, that's the last one, probably. What's that? It's for you, it's a Build-A-Bear. That's for me? Yeah. What is it? It's a Build-A-Bear. You got me a Build-A-Bear? Yeah. Why? It's a voice message too in it. It has a voice message? Yeah, from your show where you said if someone got you a Build-A-Bear. Oh my god, so I did, I did a TikTok one time where the girl in the audience was saying it was a red flag that a guy brought her a Build-A-Bear on a first date. And I had said in the video, I was like, I would love if somebody brought me a Build-A-Bear. So you brought me one? Yeah. I gotta do more jokes about getting my dick sucked. <laughs> I doing with all this cute shit? Oh god, thanks I guess. This is so sweet, thank you. Oh, your numbers are on here. It might still happen. It might still happen. Okay. We can use them for cleanup. Can I take them out of here? Yeah. This is so cute. Aww. You didn't really, you didn't spring to get him any clothes? That's kind of the whole, you didn't really build the bear. You just kind of, you kind of just, psst, looks like you stole one, kind of. There's a voice my one? Yeah, press his paw. Press his paw? What if I press it and it's just like, I want you to fuck both of us. It might be the other one. <laughs> That sucks, I can't lie. That's, um, that's uh, it's not incredibly audible, but it's a thought that counts. Thank you so much. This is, this is one of the, the sweetest, laziest gifts I've ever had. Thank you. Oh, back in there you go. There we go. Has anybody ever seen a ghost? Have you really? Wait, hold on, before you get into this, does anybody have any weed? Wait, do you really? What do you have? You have a whole joint? What does she have? You have a, pe a dab pen? Can I, am I allowed to have this? Can I have? Why does it look like a pregnancy test? <laughs> Tastes like urine. It's called Ghost. <laughs> what? If this isn't a sign, I don't know what is. Oh my God. Does that mean your kid's not gonna make it? <laughs> I have a friend who, around places where things happen, things have happened, she'll like feel weird. like. On our uh, college campus, there's this tree, and oh when she first toured, she walked by the tree, and she just felt like she was choking. And they like looked it up later, and that's like the tree where a bunch of lynchings would happen. And like all through her childhood, like like certain places would give her like headaches or like bad feelings, and like uh, they would look it up, and it's like, oh, that's the bridge where like everyone commits suicide over and over and over, and just like make her physically feel ill. So do you think like if if she entered a room where two people just got done just fucking the shit out of each other. She would be like, oh. I'm choking again. Oh my God.
I was like, no, they used to shoot porn in this room. Ooh. You never know. Cemeteries. Do you have anything you want on your tombstone? <laughs> you guys ever um, think about this? Like, cause that's like the thing that people see your name, your year. <laughs> what was code, it? A QR code. A QR code? <laughs> a QR code to what? Your OnlyFans? <laughs> God rest her soul, but them titties can come back. God damn. About to give me a resurrection. A res erection. Come on. Man, y'all gotta hit this ghost shit. This is, uh... <laughs> this is my security in case any of y'all on your Will Smith shit right now. <laughs> like, getting offended and running up on stage. Keep my wife's name out your fucking hands. <laughs> Cause yeah, never mind. Whatever. <laughs> That's such a cool skill, man. This is like you solve an imaginary Rubik's Cube. <laughs> it's just killing shit. Is uh... Anybody gay? <laughs> anybody at all? Anybody, anybody in the vicinity? <laughs> I know you're good with your hands, dog. Oh, I know it, dog. I know it. <laughs> This man will jerk you off with a poem. <laughs> You're so sweet. I've just never been in this position before. This is so much fun. <laughs> oh, the sacrifice. Did my interpreter just get gentrified? I don't understand. <laughs> who, um, who, who are you signing for? I didn't, I don't, I didn't even know. Um, I'm not sure. She said back there. <laughs> no, it is not you, bitch. You've been here in the whole show for sure. You make us wish we were all deaf, to be honest. Uh, you don't sound deaf at all. You sound, this just seems so extra. What was your name? Nicole. Nicole. Great to meet you, Nicole. How did you, um, how did you hear about the show? Um, fuck. No, 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 no. <laughs> Nice to meet you guys. This is so exciting. Thanks for coming. I just, I just wanted to know. Yeah. Sounds like you don't need to be here, to be honest. Right? <laughs> yeah. So everybody be nice. Especially you feisty. I like your energy a lot. I'll come back there and take your fucking batteries out. I swear to God. <laughs> I swear to God, I'll turn, I'll turn you off. All right. <laughs> Y'all gotta chill the fuck out, man. If I have her sign something, will you relay it verbally? Sure. Yes. All right. <laughs> you didn't know this was Deaf Comedy Jam, did you? You didn't know. Have <laughs> you ever seen a ghost? Yes, I have. I have back here. I have hey, <laughs> there's six of us in here. I saw you. Me, 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 What's, what's your? I actually have a demon in my closet. Oh, and, and the funny thing is, my ex-boyfriend sent it to my house after I broke up with him. Oh, <laughs> that's how you win a breakup. That's how. That's how you do that shit. It actually almost got into bed with her. Actually. It almost got into bed with her. So I was, I was going to sleep. Shh. 
Spanish. <laughs> In Spanish. I thought I heard it going out, but then the covers behind me lifted up and dropped back down, and I couldn't go. You had a monster come to the foot of your bed. It was mumbling some kind of language you didn't understand, and then you thought it went away, and the covers beside you in bed lifted up and then let back down. You farted. Shut up. <laughs> God. Nice try. Ugh, smells like eggs in here. Must be a demon. <laughs> I think our house is haunted, bro. Yeah. <laughs> Do you hear that grumbling? Yeah, bitch, that's your gut. Seems <laughs> sick right now. <laughs> Backtrack. Hold on. How did your how did your ex send a demon to you? He did like witchcraft stuff. He did witchcraft? This is already on you. <laughs> At what point in this relationship was he like, I'm a witch? Oh, well, also, real quick, aren't males wizards? <laughs> yes. So he, was a, he was a wizard. You, you, he threatened to kill you. Why? Because I broke up with him. Valid. Well, I broke up with him the day before the year anniversary. A day before the year anniversary? Come on, bitch, you couldn't have waited two more days? <laughs> you couldn't have had the anniversary and then one day after be like, that was really fun, but... I don't think it would have been worse if I celebrated the year with him and then broke up. I don't think so. <laughs> I think he probably had some shit planned, maybe a sacrifice. <laughs> for the, Me, for the one... Sacrifice. You don't look like a virgin. I don't think it was... Gonna be <laughs> How was the dick, though? <laughs> That's why you make a deal with the devil right there. Like, I'll sell my soul for just six, Lord. I swear to God. Please. <laughs> I've never seen a demon. I don't imagine. Have you seen an angel? Um, yes. I actually saw <laughs> I keep hitting you with shit that I'm like, this is the end of the conversation for sure. I just saw one too. demon I meant. I mean a demon. That girl looks like she'll suck your soul out. <laughs> Just in case. How far along are you? Seven months? Oh my god, it's almost here. It fucking hurts, right? Yeah. What would, if you could compare like a guy having to go through, like what do you think we would have to go through to, to, to experience something like that? Like anal. Anal? <laughs> Doesn't sound that bad. <laughs> I think it's a lot worse than anal, I, I would imagine. I think it's, it's a different pain. I mean, you've taken a big shit before, you know? <laughs> That's basically anal, you know what I mean? Every dude in here has taken a shit so big that you're like, I could be gay, dude. Like, this, this was light work, you know what I mean? Nothing, bro. Stop it! Stop it! <laughs> no. Mila and... Roberto. Roberto? Umberto? Sure. I haven't heard that one before. Okay. What about you, Umberto? What are you doing? Uh, I'm a deputy sheriff. You're a sheriff? For real? I didn't mean anything I said. I, I, I was just fucking around up here. You know what I mean? I don't even, I, it's a cool name. You've never shot anybody? You shot in somebody. <laughs> does that scare you about him like having to have a job like that that's so dangerous? It does? Yeah, if I wait like well if I don't get a response within like two hours, I'm like, this is not dead. If you don't get a response within the two hours, you just think he's dead? Yeah. It's not, it, no, that he could just be cheating. Like that's not that's not what it's that's 
serious. It's not always that. Y'all gotta get some more black friends, bro. I'm telling you, man. Black dudes are so fucking. Oh, y'all read a book. Uh, I've got ESPN. <laughs> y'all gotta step the fuck up, bro. Thank you. Yeah, it's beautiful. Boy, you making me scared. Don't do that. Jesus Christ. Especially in the dark. I can't even fight you back there, bro. It's... Jesus Christ. See what I mean? Don't say it, be it. What? What? You ain't a nigga, but act like one. No. I didn't say it. I was given a script. I just played the part, okay? I want to thank the Academy. <laughs> so I just found out apparently I'm colorblind. Don't know how long that's been going on for, but man, I tell you what, shocked me too, came right out of the purple. Some people say that I've got a tiny cock, which is accurate. His name is Winston. He's my favorite. And now I have a tiny cock, at least I've got a huge pin. Want to know how to pleasure a woman? I know this. I know this one. Guys, you listen to her. Ladies, am I wrong? I seem frustrated. We thought maybe a gift might help. I seem frustrated. A gift maybe help? Maybe after the show. <laughs> <laughs> oh, no. Thank you so much. What is this? Well, don't clap. It could be a bomb. We don't know. We don't know yet. I came to Iowa and I guess. Like, That's because of Listen, guys, I've never ended a show early before, but I, I'm sure you would all understand if I had to wrap things up, right? There's, hold on, there's one more thing in here. Cookies! Are you kidding me? The blowjob's gonna have a hard time beating this. this is fantastic. It's like the perfect consistency, too. Oh my God. Thank you so much. What's your name? Christina, you are so hot. Thank you so much. Oh my God. You're a grandma? Yeah. Let's put that shower chair to use. There's already plastic on the furniture. Let's make a mess, you know? How old are you? Say it. Say it. <laughs> this is dirty talk to me. Come on, let's go. Forty-five. Forty-five? Are you serious? Are you from? Are you from here? Really? We gotta get you out of here. We gotta get you the fuck out of here. Minneapolis, at least. Let's just get you out. Let's just get you down the road. You're not married or anything. You bunch of fucking idiots. Oh my god, you local morons not marrying this beautiful woman who makes great cookies. <laughs> Stupid. I'm so sorry. What, are you divorced? How long were you married for? 16 years. 16 years? Ah, I'm so sorry. <laughs> How many kids do you have? Four. Oh, what? That's enough, though, right? You have your tubes tied? You do? I'ma fucking move in the morning. Yeah. Uh. Those are your sisters? You have three sisters? Uh, I'm the oldest out of nine. Nine? <laughs> Would you like to have such a hot older sister? Does she know she's hot? Does she know that? No. no. She doesn't? No. Good. Keep her humble. You're nothing, Christina. <laughs> <laughs>
you're gonna be stuck here in Iowa forever, unless, unless, well, well, that's gaslighting. <laughs> What's that? What was it? What did you want to show me? Was it a bank statement? What was it? Your daughter? This is your daughter? Show us. Are you serious? No, nobody else can see her, actually. This is, I don't want Iowa to know she's out here. This is, this is your daughter? How old is she? This is the 21 year old? This is a very tough decision to make, you guys. I don't know if you've ever been put in this position, but. She's in Jacksonville, Florida? I'll be down there. I think later on this year. She looks exactly like you. This is insane. Yes, she does. She's gorgeous. All right, so I'm gonna date you for the next 10 years, and then we'll, we'll trade up. Fuck, this is about to be the most uncomfortable Thanksgiving I've ever been to in my life. Damn. Yeah, because if you taste this good, it's gonna be a problem. <laughs> What's your biggest fear? Uh, losing, my kids. losing your kids. You might find them. <laughs> no, that's, that's bad. <laughs> but if the one in Jacksonville goes missing, mind your business. <laughs> She's in good hands. <laughs> Got your phone? All right, let's swipe out of Instagram and see what else is in here. <laughs> now let's go through a photo album. Let's, um... No, wait. <gasps> Here's the thing. Here's the thing. I won't open it if you just tell me what's in there. I had a lump in my breast. Is you had a lump in your breast? I had a mammogram. You had a mammogram yeah. recently? Mm -hmm. And so I FaceTimed my daughter, the hot one. Uh huh. <laughs> oh, yeah, you're not gonna ask for ugly people's advice. <laughs> yeah, I totally get it. So there's screenshots of her and I FaceTimed me. With just a tit out. <laughs> Fuck. <laughs> Cause like you know it's in the palm of your hand. <laughs> ah! Did you get the results back? Yes. You're okay. I'm okay. Need a second opinion? <laughs> <laughs> Are you sure? Text messages. Text Maggie. Is that Maggie your daughter? FaceTimer. <laughs> Maggie, that is not your angle. <laughs> Where are you right now? Do you, do, you, do, you, do you know how hot your mom is? I know, I know. You're well aware of your competition, right? Like, you know you can't bring anybody home. I know. Um, your mom was stupid enough to, to give me her phone, and I was going through your guys' text history, and uh, gross. But I'm glad, I'm glad she got that lump checked out, though. I checked it out. Everything's totally okay. Second opinion. Everything's totally all right. see your kitties? Sure did. Sure did. And, um... You're a lucky motherfucker. I don't know. Hi, right, Maggie, say bye to your mom real quick. Bye, Mom. I love you. Bye, Maggie. <laughs> Hear them? What do you mean? They fucked them up. What do you mean they fucked them up? <laughs> Who fucked up your titties? <laughs> the doctor? Do you have fake boobs? Fuck. Um. 
prove it. <laughs> what do you? They make sounds. Like, like what? Like, like what? What? What sound do fake titties make? Cha-ching. <sighs> Thank you guys for coming on this date with Christina. And I. <laughs> I hope you guys have thoroughly enjoyed watching me ruin this family. <laughs> what was that? What the fuck? You're lying. That did not just happen. You was that a real thing? Has a squeaky toy in her titties. And you talking to a doll. That's <laughs> crazy. Oh, oh. What? I don't think that's a mistake. I think that's the best thing to have ever happened. You can get squeaky toys inside your titties? Can you customize them like a Tesla horn? What made you get them done? Four kids. Four kids. You breastfeed? Two of them. Two of them? Damn. Because you know it goes great with cookies. <laughs> Milk. <laughs> Silicone. <laughs> Texting right now. <laughs> you scheduling some dick? What are you doing? What's the move? You were just looking? That's worse. <laughs> Who are you texting right now? You were just looking at who's text. I saw the I saw the blue bubbles on there. <laughs> Who was it? <laughs> who's more important than me right now? I want to know who's number one in your life right now. Who is it? No, I was just looking. You were just looking at what? It better be pictures of me. <laughs> it better have been my Instagram. Yes. Show me if it was me. And bitch, don't you scroll to another app. I swear to God, if you open another app, you want to be real? Be present. What is your name? Lana. Lana? Lana. Lana? Lana. You're saying exactly what I'm saying. Lana. Lana. <laughs> Lana? Lana. Did I not just fucking say that? Spell it. L O R N A. L O R N A. Lorna. Not even a real name. I see why you mispronounced it. Lorna? What's your last name? The Rings? Lorna of the Rings? Whatever, dude, you fucking nerds. Whatever. <laughs> you drove 200 miles for me to sit on your phone? <laughs> Were you checking directions for the drive back? Is that what it was? Mm. <laughs> what was that? That was just four vowels in a row. Bro, British people just say fuck consonants, dude. <laughs> Look at me and my ball. Bro, who the fuck are you people, dude? Say letters. You just dip on half the words sometimes. <laughs> what do you do? I'm a buyer. You're a buyer? Oh. Uh, <laughs> we're all buyers. You won't even say it. Why? Is it people? Like, what is it? What do you mean buy it? How bad could it possibly be? I, I buy aluminium. <laughs> she just said something that was so not a word. Aluminium? Aluminium? 
dumb enough? <laughs> die! Die! Avada Kedavra! Avada Kedavra! Avada Kedavra! You're all dead! You're all so dead, dude! Oh, fuck y'all, man. That's not a word. <laughs> Aluminium? Where are all the extra letters coming from? You're doing too much. All the aluminium. <laughs> no, fuck that, guys. You're wrong. I'm, in th I'm, I'm thinking of the spelling of it in my head. There's no I after the M. Alum. <laughs> nope. Not gonna do this right now. You're not gonna. You don't have to make me look stupid. <laughs> Aluminum. you guys, dude. You get one word right and you think you're fucking hot shit. I'm from Saudi Arabia. You're from Saudi Arabia? Yeah. Welcome to Ohio. <laughs> <laughs> it's, uh, if it, is this your first time in Columbus? Mm, sorry. Yeah. <laughs> oh, you guys are from Cleveland. Oh, never mind. Enjoy Columbus. <laughs> so much better. <laughs> Our crack is pure. <laughs> He misses Saudi Arabia so much, he came all the way to Cleveland to find some bomb-ass pussy. Isn't that crazy? <laughs> How's the comedy scene in Saudi Arabia? People, do, people, do people laugh? Yeah. Most of the men? Uh, <laughs> I didn't get your names, I'm so sorry. I'm Kaylee. Kaylee and what? <laughs> okay, I'm gonna make it easy. I'll make it easy for me, let's go. Like saying dude, but you're gonna add W, so widude. Like dude, but with a W, widude. But it's mean the most lover in Arabic. It means the most lover? Yeah. Aww. Yeah. You big dick slinger, are you? Aww. Oh my god. You and your weapon of mass destruction. Aww, he's so cute. Do you really wanna know my full name? I wanna know your full name more than anything. You gonna take a note? No, I got it. It's all up here, dog. If someone said, I'm gonna give it whatever they want. Really? Yeah. You'll give me whatever I want if I can yeah. pronounce your name if correctly. You say my full name. Will you give me whoever I want? Yeah. Oh. <laughs> you can't do that here, my dude. You can't do that. You can't just be giving people away, okay? Anymore. Hey guys, we haven't always been a cool country, okay? Ah, right, well, dude, lay it on me, dog. It's Abdul Wadud, Abdul Rahim, Ruh Al Amin, Abdul Amin. Yo, somebody put this motherfucker in reverse. Did y'all hear that shit? Oh, sounds like somebody rewound this motherfucker. It sounds like he was like, I'm new here, I love America, Cleveland is awesome, Columbus is so much better. Take it back one more time. We have to have our parents and grandpas and great grandpas and then family. So you will be known when someone like me, you out there, uh -huh. like, oh, is that your grandpa? Oh, that's your grandson? So that's how we know each other. That was more confusing than your name was, to be honest. That was far more confusing. I love you, dog. I really do. Absolute pleasure to meet you, man. Pleasure to meet you, too. Uh, what'd you say? Well, it's my pleasure to meet you, too. Oh, you said it so right for me. <laughs> he, said, he said it with like a strong accent at first, but then he went, it is my pleasure to meet you, too. It's like when I turn into Siri real quick. You're a cool ass dude, man. So, Columbus, we, uh, we gotta get out of here. Uh, I know, I know, I know. Somebody's gonna catch a flight. <laughs> Texting right now. <laughs> you scheduling some dick? What are you doing? <laughs> what's, 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 the, what's the move? <laughs> you were just looking? That's worse. <laughs> Who are you texting right now? You were just looking at who's tech. I saw the I saw the blue bubbles on there. <laughs> Who was it? <laughs> who's more important than me right now? I want to know 
Who's number one in your life right now? Who is it? No, I was just looking. You were just looking at what? It better be pictures of me. <laughs> it better have been my Instagram. Yes. Show me if it was me. And bitch, don't you scroll to another app. I swear to God. If you open another app. You want to be real? Be present. What is your name? Lana. Lana? Lana. <laughs> Lana? Lana. You're saying exactly what I'm saying. <laughs> Lana. Lana. <laughs> Lana? Lana? Did I not just fucking say that? Spell it. L O R N A. Lorna. Not even a real name. I see why you mispronounced it. Lorna? What's your last name? The Rings? One of the Rings? Oh, whatever, dude. You fucking nerds. Whatever. <laughs> you drove 200 miles for me to sit on your phone? Were you checking directions for the drive back? Is that what it was? Mm. <laughs> what was that? That was just four vowels in a row. <laughs> Bro, British people just say fuck consonants, dude. Look at me and my ball. Bro, who the fuck are you people, dude? Say letters. You just dip on half the words sometimes. What do you do? I'm a buyer. You're a buyer? Oh. Uh, we're all buyers. I can't even say it because... You won't even say it? Why? Is it people? Like, what is it? What do you mean buy? How bad could it possibly be? She just said something that was so not a word. Aluminium? Aluminum! Die! Die! Avada Kedavra! Avada Kedavra! Avada Kedavra! You're all dead! You're all so dead, dude! Oh, fuck y'all, man. That's not a word. Aluminium? Where are all the extra letters coming from? You're doing too much! All the aluminium. No, fuck that, guys. You're wrong. I'm, in th I'm, I'm thinking of the spelling of it in my head. There's no I after the M. Alum. Nope. Not gonna do this right now. You're not gonna. You don't have to make me look stupid. Aluminum. you guys, dude. You get one word right and you think you're fucking hot shit. Oh, there you are. Yeah, you. No. No, I looked over. I was like, there's an empty chair there. I was like, where'd she go? You were taking a shit. It's fine. It's fine. No one's gonna have a job. Oh, I'm embarrassing you. In front of everybody. Okay, Wednesday. Yeah, Wednesday, Adam. You just got it. <laughs> oh, you're sweet. I'm just fucking with you. I love you. I love you too. Oh, really? Yeah. <laughs> I was just making sure in the bathroom that I look good for you. That's it. You were just making sure in the bathroom that you look good for me? Yeah. Do a double take. <laughs> Oh my god, this is 
is fun. Oh, shit. <laughs> Can I tell you you look pretty just to make you feel better? First of all, you never need a man to tell you you look beautiful. So, no. <laughs> no, you, you look great. You look great. You. Yes, I mean it. We just said we're gonna meet out in the back. <laughs> no. No. I love you too. You're very sweet. Yeah. Yes. I love watching you. Oh man. I wish you would love listening to me. You look so good. One of us has to. I'm kidding. You guys can't see my side of the room. She, she is very beautiful. Yeah. <laughs> is she your birthday? That explains it. <laughs> How old are you turning? 21. 21? That explains it. Would you like the rest, man? Come here. Forearms on you, says her sisters. <laughs> What's your name? Casey. Casey and Jesse. Jesse. Pleasure to meet you, Casey and Jesse. You guys are adorable. Where'd you guys meet? In Columbus, Ohio? You guys drove from Ohio? You're not even allowed to be gay up there. That's crazy. <laughs> what? Stay down here. Well, well, <laughs> maybe. Let's go west a little bit. Yeah, um. You got here yesterday. Are you going back tomorrow? Did you guys do anything fun for Easter? Repent, maybe? <laughs> Did you guys go to church this morning? You had food poisoning? Fuck. Eating the wrong fish. <laughs> That's Jesus saying clean up your life. I'm kidding, I'm kidding, I'm kidding, I'm kidding. Now what's Penn's Mechanical exactly in, in Columbus? An arcade bar, like um, pinball machines and stuff like that. Nice. Just work on your finger and just. <laughs> <laughs> Interesting. Do you remember who, who'd you come out to first? You don't mind me asking. Your friends? And did they know? They were like, "Yeah, bitch, you you look you dress like that. You don't skateboard at all. <laughs> You're young. You don't have to do it anytime soon. What would you ever want, kids? You think?" If I'm rich. If you're rich? Yeah. Well, you're going to have to stop working at an arcade bar. <laughs> That's step number one. Oh, man. I go through backpacks like crazy. Like, because I fly so much, they always fuck up my bags. It's always the, like, the, the, the lining on, like, where the strap meets the actual backpack. It gets fucking torn. I'm always carrying so much shit. I, I go through more straps than you guys do. <laughs> trying to get to it. I was like, how can I, how can I squeeze that in without any lube, you know? Mm. That's so cute, man. I wish I was gay. Yeah. I'd never pay for it. <laughs> you calm down back there before I have her come back there and peg the shit out of you. Okay? I swear to God. What gets in the way the most? Communication, I guess. Communication, that's a big one. Well, it doesn't always need to be verbal, you know. I'm sure you guys are pros at reading lips. You know, settle it, rock, paper, scissors. You know, like adults. You got your foot up on stage the whole, you hella comfortable, man. What, what kind of work you need those boots for? Electrical contractor. Electrical contractor, nice. You ever been electrocuted? I have, well, shot. You been shocked? Yeah. Like finding out your daughter's a lesbian? <laughs> <gasps> we did IVF. 
You did IVF, inver, infertile, in, uh, uh, <laughs> infertile vitro asphyxiation. <laughs> they put eggs yeah. and semen inside you, yeah. and then they just fucking. So this is my impression of them after an argument. <laughs> Did you know it was going to be two? Like, did you know you were selecting twins? Yes. Oh, really? I didn't know you could do that. Sex. You had to choose. <laughs> Bro, <laughs> you scared the shit out of me, dog. <laughs> Bro, I'm not Chris Rock, though. I'll kick you in your chest, bro. I swear to God. <laughs> are you dapping me or you want the hoodie or my wallet? What do you want? <laughs> careful, dog. Careful. <laughs> Do y'all watch Criminal Minds? Yeah. All right, hey, one handsome motherfucker at a time, dog. Yeah. you have some fun? I ain't got jokes like this motherfucker right here. <laughs> I'm Jamar Moore. Tonight, I'm seeing him live in person, like a lot of us, I'm sure, for the first time. But I've been watching him, me and my girl, my baby mama. And, I, and my girl comes to me and she's like, Shamari, you're the sexiest motherfucker in the world, Jenny. You're the father of my daughter, but I want to fuck Matt right. Check this out. We're going to go meet the motherfucker, but you ain't going to fuck. <laughs> but the, re the reason I'm here. It's because I like seeing motherfuckers win. I like seeing motherfuckers win. And this, and this, this young white boy, who wants to say nigga so bad? <laughs> because all his friends are black. <laughs> but he can't say it, because he'll get cast. But when he comes to my house, I'm going to say, get it out of your system. Nigga, 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 nigga. is because I've never met this man. I just watched him on YouTube. And I was like, yo, this motherfucker's funny. And he's pretty. And, and no, but they're like, pretty people ain't supposed to be fun. Kevin Hart is not pretty. He's short and he's funny. Chris Tucker, motherfucking damn! Okay? Dave Chappelle is rich as fuck. He's not Chef. pretty. True. I'm pretty, goddamn. But he's honest, he's real, and he's funny. And I DM'd him like a bitch. And he DM'd me back like a bitch. So now we got a romance going on. And I said, I'm gonna come to your show, and I'll pay you like a bitch. But he did give me the tickets for free. So I'm gonna get off the stage, but I just wanna say, I believe that this dude is on his way. He sells out every show. And I believe, I believe you are going to see Matt right. And whatever is in his heart, and with all, all his jokes, and all of that stuff. And I want to see this motherfucker in front of a bunch of dicks. Because I think he can handle himself. But my point is, let's applaud the bravery, the boldness, the unapologetic Matt Wright. And let's watch him grow. Let's watch him grow. Appreciate you, man. Thank you, brother. Thank Respect. you, man. Thank you, bro. Can I add it? He's stealing. <laughs> Go stairs this way. Yeah, be careful. One more time for Tay Diggs.